All right, hello everybody. It's Tortle and welcome back to another video. Today, I'm actually recording me playing the game. And if you didn't see my last video, which explains what I'm doing today and all of that, um, I'm actually going to be recording the Dungeons and Dragons Legacy Challenge that I created myself with some help, but it was mostly me. Um, <laughs> And I read off some of the rules for Generation 1, which is barred in the last video I did of the creative sim of this lovely sim here, Micah Carrington. There he is. What a handsome boy. Anyway, I know the lot looks like really empty right now, but that's because I actually have to build something. Um, actually, a friend of mine built something for me to use in this build. So I'll be right back. I'm just going to place that lot here, decorate it, put some stuff up on it, and then I will um, be back when it's done. And welcome back, everybody. Um, if you weren't here last time when I recorded the create -a sim of Micah here, um, I did read off the rules and requirements for the Dungeons & Dragons challenge. But I'm going to read them again just in case you don't want to go back and watch the creative sim, which is completely understandable. I know creative sims aren't for everybody. I just like doing them because they require very little mental taxation. <laughs> so first generation, Micah, is a bard. And the traits for bard, let me get his traits up, are music lover, outgoing, and romantic. And his aspiration is musical genius. There's also a second route you can go where you go into the acting career and all that. But since we're not doing that one, we don't have to worry about it. Um, the requirements are he has to complete his aspiration and the entertainer career, which he hasn't joined yet. So we should probably do that. And he has to master the comedy skill and two instruments. And once we get inside of his house, you guys will see the instruments uh, I've chosen for him. He also has to complete a collection, which I'm not sure which one he's going to do living in Strangerville, but we'll figure it out. If you have any that you think he, you, he would collect, uh, let me know in the comments, in my Discord, whatever, and I'll look into it and see if I can get it. Um, actually, I do have the My First Pet stuff, so maybe he could go get like the pets, the postcards or something. I don't know. Anyway, this is his house. Um, my friend, uh, Lil Crow Kid, built it. I will have their gallery ID as well as mine in the description below if you want to download this house. Um, it's a little under 6000 because it's not furnished on the inside, but I went and I furnished it. Um, he added some, like, planter boxes and a chicken coop. I don't think we're going to raise chickens because he's not a farmer. He looks like a cowboy, but he's not. <laughs> he's, he's just... He's, he's in it for the aesthetic. And I completely forgot to go over the last two requirements, but we'll get there eventually. So here's his tiny trailer. These are the two instruments he's going to be using, the violin and the guitar. And then this is his really crappy bed that I got from the show live edit and show hidden objects cheats from Eco Living. You can find this bed either... In the, gallery, in, in the gallery, in build buy mode by using cheats to get it, or you can find it in a dumpster because it's a dumpster bed. He's got this cracked mirror from uh, Werewolves, and he's got this rug from Werewolves, and this chair was actually came with the house, and it was outside, but I decided to put it inside because why not? He's got the crappy TV from Eco Lifestyle that you can also find in the dumpster. And then in here, he's got his kitchen, uh, I used a lot of city living in this build because they've got like some not great appliances like this fridge, the oven, and the counters. And then this table's from Eco Lifestyle. I think you can craft it, but I'm not sure. Chairs and wallpapers from Eco Lifestyle. And then the bathroom is very minimally decorated because he doesn't have much money. Ignore the fact that he has 8,000 simoleons left. I have to fix that. <laughs> Anyway, I'm just going to fix that now. Uh, money. We'll give him like a thousand because that seems... Uh, I forgot to test cheats. Oh no. Oh no. 
Testing, cheats, true money, 1,000. Not 10,000, Jesus. I'm crazy, uh, just ignore me, y'all, I'm, I'm losing it. Okay, so he's entered the career, he makes 23 simoleons an hour, which is great. Um, he either has to practice music or write jokes. Uh, I think you have to have a computer to write jokes, so we're just gonna practice music. I think we're gonna go with the violin first. Ooh, can I, I can't sell these, that's bullshit. So he's gonna go inside and he's gonna come play the crafted violin. I picked the crafted violin because it felt like more cheap and didn't look so like classy. Cause I don't, he, he's a classy, he's a classy guy, but I don't think he's like, I don't think he's rich enough to just go buy a really good violin. He's gonna stick with this not great violin. Anyway, the last two requirements for this generation are to have children with two different sims before getting married and marry a non-human sim. I said this in my Discord, but if you guys would like to make sims that he can either be friends with, he could be lovers with, whatever, you can upload them to the gallery. I'll have a hashtag in the description below. Um, I think, I do believe the hashtag is Tortles Legacy Challenge. I just have to go check um, my Discord real quick because I cannot remember anything for the life of me. Um, you'll notice that there's no sound coming from the game. It's because I turned all the noises off because they really get on my nerves. But they they will be on in the next video because um, I don't my, my talking ability is not great. <laughs> So I, I need a little more noise to like keep everybody from getting bored. Uh, the hashtags, the hashtag for the, if you guys want to like make sims for him, for me to put in the game, is Tortles Legacy Sim. So you can just upload a sim to that and I I will at some point in another video, look through the sims you guys have created and put them in the world so he might run into them. Um, it could be a lover, it could be a friend, it could be his future husband or wife. He's bisexual, so he he swings both ways. Because why wouldn't he? He's a bard. <laughs> but um, if you would like to test out this challenge, I'll Put it up in my Discord because it's I, I haven't played through it completely so I have no idea if it's playable or not. And I also have no idea if anybody would actually be interested in playing it. So if you're interested you are free to join my Discord. The link is always in the description below and you'll be able to find the link to the challenge there. Uh, but for now we're just gonna watch him do the violin. I'm gonna speed him up a little bit and check this. Oh gosh. 75% done and then for his aspiration we have to practice music for six hours that's a long time and listen to music for two hours we don't have a stereo so that's that's gonna suck oh look the weird people from strangerville are showing up i'm not gonna do the strangerville uh story in this generation so we're just gonna send them away um i might do it in like a future generation if you guys would like to see that, I've played through the Strangerville story a million times already. It's probably one of my favorite stories to play through because it's just so fun. Hey, he's got to level two. Let's go. I think we're making pretty good progress. But um, if you guys would like to see another, a future sim do the Strangerville challenge in this challenge, I'll do it. I'll do anything to ap appease my 10 viewers. <laughs> but right now he's just gonna do his violining. And how's he feeling? How's his moods? His mood's pretty high. Um, I'm not really sh I've never recorded an actual video of me playing the game, so I have no idea how to, like, what should he do. I think my first mistake was moving him into Strangerville because he can't talk to any of his neighbors because they're all infected. So we might, 
once he reaches, once he's like halfway to level three, we'll like go to the bar and meet some Sims. Um, I I don't think he's gonna meet any of his future baby mamas in or baby daddies. I don't know in this episode, but I do think he might like make a friend or two, whichever. Okay, he's got to like four hours. Okay, we only need two hours left. I do eventually want to get the thing where they can like play for tips, but I think you have to be a certain level of the skill, like the instrument to be able to do that. I think it's like level four. So that'll be like for a future episode. He'll go to like the bar and play for tips and maybe that's how he'll meet one of his lovers. Um, as soon as this game loads, we'll go to the bar and get some drinks and make some friends. Oh, I'm, I suck at this. It's okay. We're, we're in this together. <laughs> um, but I'm definitely, I definitely need to put on the music for the game at some point. So it's not completely silent and awkward and weird. Like me, I am awkward and weird. All right, let's scope the surroundings. Who all is here? Eleanor Elderberry is the barista. Don't you live in freaking Brightchester? Who are you trying to talk to? This guy? What's his name? Drumpk? Drumpk? Oh, Puni. I butchered that real bad. He apparently doesn't want to talk to us though. He's disappeared. He's gone. He has left the building. All right, we're gonna go get a drink, some juice on the rocks. And then I'm gonna turn on the jukebox because he needs to listen to music. Um, I don't know what Americana music is. <laughs> so if you know what that is, I would love to know. I'm gonna turn on some, I don't know, strange tunes, why not? All right, he's talking to people, he's talking to people. This is Hector Laurent from Tartosa. He's very angry. Let's get to know him, ask about his day. Oh, I keep getting stuck behind that thing on the wall. It's actually a really nice decor item though. Um, and here's M Meredith. Yes, Meredith Roswell. She's a townie from Strangerville, if you don't know. Which you probably do, but now you definitely know. So he's just talking to Laurent and Janae and Lady Miss Elderberry. Whoever this is, who's this? Um, Ayumi Oda. All right, are you cute? Let me see. Oh, you kind of are for a townie, for a pre-generated townie. If you don't play the sims usually pre-generated townies do are not cute they end up coming out natalie ralston you look angry irritated even who's this fernando branham hey you're you've got a face um i don't know if it's a good one I'm so rude, I'm sorry. <laughs> Who's he talking to now? Chat with Guillermo. Where is he? Where is Guillermo? Paige Pollock. He's gonna listen to music. He's not listening to it. He's just, it's just on. Okay, um, listen deeply to strange tunes. There's Guillermo. All right, Paige Pollock, I'm gonna look at your face. She's kind of cute. She's got some bushy eyebrows, but I also have bushy eyebrows, so. Can I get some love for the bushy eyebrow gang? He's listening deeply. Look at that boot tap. He's so cute. Um, I did do a create a sim of him, so if you want to go see that, it's up on my channel. 
Um, it's the last video that I posted. Um, I'm very proud of him, actually. Oh, he's gonna use the bathroom. Crap. Crap. Um, you're gonna notice I like to have my Sims' needs taken care of immediately as soon as they turn yellow because I hate when my Sims are, like, really angry because they didn't get to use the bathroom. Alright, he's gonna come listen to Strange Tunes again. Might even do a little dance. Oh. Oh, the birthdays loom. They loom closely. Um, I don't, I want to take it kind of slow. So I don't want him to have kids like within the first week. But at the same time, I feel like he needs to have kids within the first week or he's not like succeeding. Um, let me know what you guys think. If you think he should wait for a little bit. Or if he should just immediately have them now. I think he should wait, but I'm not really sure. Uh, again, if you guys, I'm all about, who are you? No, it's still Natalie. She has, just has a different uniform out on, why don't you get to know her? Introduce yourself. She's an older woman. He likes MILFs. She might not be a mom though, so <laughs> she's just uh, older. She's actually really cute. She's gone prematurely gray though. <laughs> That's funny. Anyway, um, yeah, I, uh, I'm struggling so hard. I'm, I apologize. Um, this is the first time I'm recording a video that isn't sped up and doesn't have to, that isn't ending in like five minutes. So I'm a little nervous about how it's going to come out, whether people are actually going to enjoy it or not, stuff like that. I'm just, I'm just a little nervous. <laughs> Simeon Silver Sweater. He's actually a spellcaster. So he's a non-human sim. Not that I want Micah to get married to Simeon Silver Sweater because he's he's not our type. You know, I don't think he's our type. Miss Landgrab. Oh, you know, she would be a good baby mama. She's got money. She's got money. She is a MILF. Um, not actually. She her makeup's a little I don't wear makeup, so I really shouldn't say anything. But her makeup's a little, a little much. I, I'm kind of feeling Natalie though. She's she's got she's got a good vibe. Um, ask about woohoo interest. Whoa, take it back now, Micah. That's a little forward, don't you think? Um, do let me know though, guys. Do you think he should like have a actual relationship with his the first two people he has kids with or do you think one of them or both of them even should just be like one night stands where they don't want the baby so they give it to him or should it be a relationship where the parent other parent comes around a lot and visits the kid what do you guys think i want options i don't i don't want it to just be me i need i need help i can't make decisions by myself in the sims um Oh no, she's leaving. Natalie. Oh, she's dancing. She dancing? Or is she about to get in a fight with somebody? Talk about warm temperature. Let's just talk. I'm a funny guy. I'm a, he's a handsome guy. Oh no, he got teleported. No. Oh, Katrina Caliente is here. She's another, uh, she's actually a MILF. She's really hot. <laughs> I think he could tap it. Oh, El Faba's here too. She's there. Also a spellcaster. Um, but they're also evil. So I don't know. I don't know if he, I want him to like get married to someone who's evil. Oh, she's about to leave. He can't be introduced to her. She's leaving. Who's this? He's just, he's Deshaun. Oh, oh. I can't pronounce his last name. I apologize. He's very angry. I can't introduce myself to any of these people. Oh, hey, we got the listen to music for two hours thing done. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. I think maybe he should go home and then like prepare a meal. So that way when he's hungry, he doesn't have to make like a really bad meal. Because if you don't know, if your Sims make meals when they're uncomfortable, stressed, angry the meals come out really poor and then they get really upset because they ate 
nasty food, which is relatable. I also get really upset when I make nasty food. But um, here we go. We're just gonna go home. Um, also, if uh, you don't know, I'm actually posting another challenge that I'm creating, current like creating currently. I didn't create it already. It's still going on my Simstagram, which I'll also have in the description. If you want to go follow that and be updated about that, the main Sim is named Cyrus Valdez, I think. He's super cute and he's kind of chaotic. Not gonna lie, he's kind of chaotic. But it's okay, I, I we love a chaotic boy. And I mean, Micah's the same way. He's gonna be super chaotic for sure. All right, let's go make some food. I always start with a good garden salad because they can't burn the house down if they're not using the oven. Don't watch the TV. Actually, he probably should watch the TV a little bit so that way you can get ahead on the comedy skill. All right, hurry up. Walk faster. Um, I don't know if I should use like the laundry stuff because the laundry is kind of annoying. <laughs> Not gonna lie. And then it glitches out sometimes and it won't like let you do the laundry at all. So I might just keep these around for like decor purposes. And I might buy some like gardening stuff just for like some extra money because I, like I said before, I don't wanna have kids immediately, but I think he's gonna end up having them very soon and we need some money to like make a little, you know, nursery and stuff. No, you're not gonna eat at the table even though I made it specifically so you could eat at the table. You're gonna come watch comedy. I wish there was another way to practice comedy to where you, oh, he left his bowl on the table. So annoying. Just kidding. Um, am I the only person who kind of likes like being able to drag their like dirty bowls and stuff to the sink? It just, I don't know, it makes me feel useful as a, the, you know, god of sims right now. <laughs> so here we go. We're working on his comedy. He's f feeling fine because of this emotionally mindful thing. But he's going to be very playful in a bit, which is fun. Um, after, but after he goes, wait, when does he go to work tomorrow? At 9 a.m. All right, if he wakes up fairly early, we'll have him, well, I mean, he's not really tired. He can practice some guitar, but I really want to get him to level two before this uh, episode's over. Although the way my timer is saying, I don't know if we're going to have time to get him to level two. Uh, I really want to keep these videos in between the 20 to 25 minute mark. Simply because I don't want like a super long video because it takes my computer ages to upload stuff. And I don't want to spend 12 hours trying to upload a video <laughs> to, for tomorrow. Or well, I should say today because it's gonna be up. I mean, it's it's gonna be uploaded hopefully tomorrow because I'm gonna ex I'm gonna edit and export it tonight, and then I'm gonna upload it tomorrow. But I might have to upload it a little early because it is a little bit longer than most of the videos that I post. Uh, we'll we'll figure it out. We we will figure it out together. Um, also, I didn't mention it in the last video, but I hope everybody had a really great Christmas. And I'm really sorry I didn't upload any like Christmas things um last week i was really hoping i would be able to upload a couple what's the word uh cabins like winter cabins cozy stuff but i just my mental health was absolute garbage he's gonna have to go to sleep uh absolute garbage no i wanted you to get to level two micah oh no his clothes his clothes. Oh, I've got to. I've got to del delete this stuff so his clothes isn't going anywhere. I will be right back. All right, and I'm back from having to delete stuff. Micah, I can't believe you went. Uh, he went to sleep late as hell. Holy crap! I could never. Like I'm young. I'm a young person, but I can't. I can't be staying up. Oh, I can't be staying up all night. You know, I'm, I'm a very tired person. All right, he's hungry. He's got to pee. Let's take care of his bladder first. 
and then he can eat some more garden salad. It's 7 a.m. I don't know if he's gonna have time to do, I, I do want him to get to level two of comedy though. I want him to get the comedy out <laughs> so that way we can work on his guitar skill. Um, I can't believe I said it right that time. I didn't say it right the first time. Um, so a little like, I guess, fun fact about me. Um, I'm actually a huge D and D nerd, which should be obvious <laughs> considering what the, the fact that I made an entire Sims 4 challenge about it. Um, if you're also a D and D nerd, that's great. If you're not a D and D nerd, that's also great because it's not for everybody. Um, it's actually a 12 generation legacy challenge. Sorry for the little bouts of silence. I'm trying to text people and speak at the same time, which I really shouldn't be doing, but it's, I, 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 I feel like I can multitask even though I really can't. <laughs> anyway, um, it's a 12 generation challenge with the last two generations being um, optional. Uh, the first 10 generations are most of the basic uh, classes for Dungeons and Dragons, starting with Bard and ending with Rogue, I think. Um, and then I realized a couple months after I had finished the original challenge, I was like, oh no, I didn't add Sorcerer. So the last two generations are actually Artificer and Sorcerer. And I know, you're, you're thinking, hey, um, isn't like, hey, he got to level two. Okay. I will let you leave the TV now. He's so handsome. God. Damn. <laughs> Sorry, I make, I try to make really handsome sims, so I'm kind of proud of the fact that I was able to do this. Yay, he's going to his first day of work! Anyway, while he's at work, I'll explain the rest of the challenge, although I don't think we have time for that. It's fine, it's fine. Um, so I know you're thinking, but Tortle, isn't there like 13 classes? And yes, there are 13 classes, but I forgot to add Monk and I don't feel like going back and re-adding it. But if you think that you can come up with something that works for Monk, go ahead, give it to me and I'll put it in the generation. I just, I can't put it in there because I, Monks are, I, I've never played with a Monk, so I have no idea what they're about. I don't know what they do. Anyway, we're going to speed through this, and I will be back as soon as he's back from work. And we're back from work. Please, stop. Stop. No. Okay. We're back from work. All right, he's really got a shower. Apparently, he had a very stinky day. He's going to go take a bath, and then when he gets out of the bath, um, we're going to have him come play around on the guitar. But again, if you want to try out the challenge, oh, we don't need to see him naked. Um, I mean, I know he's pixelated, so you're not going to see anything, but I think it's weird to watch Sims bathe. So if you want to try out the challenge, or if you want to try out another challenge that I did called the Four Horsemen Challenge, which is exactly what it sounds like, um, they'll be in my uh, Discord. Also, we're approaching the end of the video, so we're not actually going to be able to watch him play with any guitar stuff, but I'm going to get, well, we might actually, because there's like two minutes and 30 seconds left, but I just want to get the ending out before I forget to do it and then I've gone over and I'm losing it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys are going to enjoy the series. Um, as I said earlier, if you want to create Sims that I can put into the game, the hashtag for the gallery will be in my description. My Discord's always in the description. My gallery ID is always in the description. The Discord link is always in the description. Did I already mention that? I don't remember. Um, and I would love to see you there. I would really love it. So once he's finished with the bath, he'll get into the guitar and I, 
we're probably gonna end the video here actually um anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this and i will see you all next time bye bye